Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating your iPad. So let's get started. Go right into your settings. Inside your settings, you should see software update right up there underneath your name or your device's name. However, if you don't see it, don't worry about it. Scroll down, you're going to see general. Under general, go right into software update, which is your second option. And from here, you should see this loading up. If nothing loads up, just turn on and off automatic updates, restart your iPad, that usually does the trick. And yes, depending which generation of iPad, you will be able to do this update. And older, really older generations will not be able to. But anyways, let's just tap on download and install. It's gonna ask you for passcode if you have one, then it's gonna download. Well, during the download process, it doesn't matter if it turns off for any reason, not really. But during the installation, yes, that matters because that's when glitches can happen. Which, by the way, I forgot to mention, you should make a backup of this iPad. So, your first option up here, like I mentioned before, was your name or your device's name. Just click there, then go and make a backup using your iCloud. If you have no more iCloud space, don't worry about it. Just hook up your iPad to your computer and you can do the backup there. Also, if you're having any problems with your iPad updating, you can also hook it up to your computer and just do the update from there. For example, on Windows, you will use iTunes and on Mac, Finder. Anyways, right now you could just leave your iPad because later on you're gonna see preparing update, but with a bar. That bar is gonna be a loading bar. It's gonna be blue. And then once that's done, you will be able to install the update. That means once it's actually downloaded and ready for you to install it on your iPad. All right, so once it's done downloading, all we have to do is tap on install now. It's gonna say verifying update. We're gonna see a black screen, an Apple logo, and a loading bar. All right, once the update's done, you're just gonna see this. Your update is all set. Put in the passcode if you have one and you're all done. You can double check just by going to there, software, and then there you go. You are all up to date. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.